What's up guys and welcome to another transfer video on the channel First of all, I hope you guys have a good Friday and weekend And first of all as well, let's try to reach 500 likes in this video guys So smash that like button, it only takes one second And it is really really important for me and for the channel to grow guys So don't forget to leave a like, please Now talking about today's video, we're gonna talk about Barcelona willing to exchange Nelson Smedu or continue with Tottenham to bring Anne Dombele to Camp Nou this summer. Also on the news, Juventus are the new team in the race to sign the Bomayang alongside with Inter and Barcelona as well. We have much much more to see in the video guys so check all of this news next in the video. Don't forget to leave a like like I said in the beginning. Enjoy, let's go! Ok guys, let's finish this week strong, Brazilian midfielder Fred is ready to discuss a new long term contract with Manchester United, reports the Sun. Despite still having 3 years to run on his current deal, Fred is eager to commit to the Red Devils and push for a wage rise after a resurgent season at Old Trafford. United are open to holding talks later this year, but are not in no rush to offer him a new contract. Out of contract, Celtic goalkeeper Craig Gordon has emerged as a target for Derby County according to the Herald. The Hops have been unable to re-sign Gordon to date, with the club and player failing to agree over the terms of a new deal. Along with Derby County, Scottish side Hearts have also offered a two-year deal to Gordon. Monaco have chosen not to give Leicester City loanee Slimani a permanent contract despite his impressive performances in the 2019-2020 league and season. Slimani helped Monaco finish in position number 9 in the league and table, scoring 9 goals and making 7 assists in 18 appearances before the French top flight was concluded due to the coronavirus pandemic in May. He joined Robert Moreno's side on a season-long loan from Leicester City last August for his third temporary stint away from the Premier League club. Arsenal star Aubameyang has attracted interest from Juventus, reports Lieutenant Sport. While yet hold any talks with the Gunners attacker, Maurizio Sarri's side are circling should he fail to sign a new contract at the Emirates. Along with Juve, Barcelona and Inter are also set to be monitoring a Bomayang situation. Tovin could be sold by Marseille due to their economic situation, according to the equipe. While the club were keen to hold on to the attacker, they may be tempted to cash in sooner than expected and could lower their 20 million euros asking price. Zinedine Zidane believes Real Madrid captain Sergio Ramos should retire at the Santiago Bernabeu amid question marks over his future. Ramos' contract expires at the end of the 2020-2021 season, by which time he will be 35 years old and it remains to be seen whether the star defender will, will remain in the Spanish capital. The Spain skipper showed he is far from finished with another inspiring performance in Madrid's 2-0 La Liga victory over Real Mallorca on Wednesday. Verona defender Kumbula is wanted by both Lazio and Inter, reports Gianluca Di Marzio. Inter have made an offer of 25 million euros plus 3 million euros in bonuses but have not been able to get a deal done. Lazio meanwhile are looking to use their good relationship with Verona to land Kumbula. Milan are desperate to tie number one goalkeeper Gianluigi Donnarumma down to a new contract according to Calcio Mercato. The 21-year-old's current deal is set to expire in 2021 and a number of top clubs are monitoring his situation at San Siro. Milan officials are prioritizing a renewal for Donnarumma above any transfers at the moment as they bid to ensure a prized asset commits his long-term future to the club. According to reports, Tottenham are in talks to sign South Korea international Kim Min Jae. Leipzig, Lazio, Southampton and Inter have also been linked with the Beijing Guan defender, but Spurs are set to win the race for his signature. Kim's current employers are likely to sanction a prized assets departure if their 15 million euros valuation is met this summer. Barcelona are willing to consider an exchange deal for Tottenham midfielder Ndombele this summer as the Independent reports. 
the Spanish champions are open to swapping either Nelson Smedo or Philippe Coutinho for the 23-year-old when the transfer window reopens. Ndombele looks set to leave Tottenham after reportedly telling head coach Jose Mourinho that he does not wish to play for him again. Matic is enjoying some of his best football amidst Ole Solskjaer, with the 31-year-old midfielder considered to be playing his way towards a new contract. The Red Devils boss has said, I'm very very happy that we are seeing the best of Matic and he will be important for us and then. Of course, it's down to performances and if Matic wants to stay, but at the moment he is in great form. Bayern Munich are ready to rival Manchester United and Bundesliga rivals Borussia Dortmund for Jude Bellingham, reports Kicker. The 16-year-old Birmingham midfielder has been attracting interest from across Europe, with the move to Germany set to appeal to the youngster. Chelsea have joined the battle to prize Dayo Topomecano away from Leipzig according to The Athletic. The highly rated defender has been heavily linked with Arsenal in the recent past, but it could be that the Premier League move to London ends up taking the Frenchman to Stanford Bridge. Rumored Arsenal target Gabriel has opened the door to a Premier League move outlining his ambition to go as high as possible in the game. Arsenal are reportedly lining up a 33 million euro swoop for the centre-back as Mikel Arteta looks to increase his options at the back. Napoli have also been linked with Gabriel, who has now admitted that the move to England or Italy holds great appeal to him. According to information by Transfer Market, Bayern Munich has brought in another talent from Offenheim youth setup, Maming Sayang. Arriving in Germany at the age of 10 as a refugee, he has played 19 games. According to information by Transfer Market, Bayern Munich has brought in another talent from Offenheim's youth setup, Maming Sayang. Arriving in Germany at the age of 10 as a refugee, he has played 19 games this season for under 17 of a 9, scoring 8 goals and assisting 4. Ansu Fati's father has dismissed rumors linking his son with a move to Manchester United, insisting everyone that leaves Barcelona then wants to come back. The Red Devils are reportedly lining up a summer approach for Fati, who is currently enjoying a breakout season at Camp Nou. The 17-year-old made his senior debut for Barca back in August and has since racked up 26 appearances for the club in all competitions, scoring 6 goals. Barcelona are considering a swoop for Paris Saint-Germain striker Cavani, as Diario Sports reports. The 33-year-old is set to become a free agent this summer and has also been heavily linked with Athletic Madrid. Barca could move to beat their La Liga rivals to Cavani's signature as a potential deal for Inter forward and first choice target Lautaro Martinez appears to be slipping out of reach. Borussia Mönchengladbach sporting director Max Eberl confirmed on Thursday we have decided not to, not to extend Rafael's contract. He has been a key player at the club and deserves a proper send-off with the fans. It was a sporting decision, but the talks were open and friendly. We part ways on a very good terms. Freiburg defender Robin Koch is the subject of interest from Tottenham, according to Bild. Spurs see the 23-year-old as the ideal replacement for Ewan Foyth, who has been tipped to join Inter this summer. Koch is seeking a transfer after deciding against extending his current contract at Freiburg, which is due to expire in 2021. Pedro has agreed to move to Serie A giants Rome, according to Sky Sports. The World Cup winner is approaching the end of his contract at Chelsea and will head to Italy as a free agent. Newcastle has confirmed that Andy Carroll has signed a new one-year deal with the club. And Newcastle again has announced as well that Javier Manquillo has signed a new four-year contract deal at Newcastle United. Pablo Zabaleta and Carlos Sanchez are among those that West Ham will be releasing the Premier League club have announced. An Argentine defender will be fondly remembered in English football after taking in an iconic spell at Manchester City. Colombian international Sanchez will be leaving London Stadium on the back of two injury seasons. Dortmund has officially announced the signing of Thomas Meunier from PSG. He came as a free agent since his contract with PSG expired. 
he will wear the number 24 at Dortmund. Liverpool has confirmed that Klein will depart the club at the end of this month upon the expiry of his contract. Los Angeles FC are in talks over a move for Guanzu forward Zahavi according to reports. The 32-year-old's current contract in China is up in December. Zahavi has previously represented Palermo and Maccabi Tel Aviv and has 19 goals in 52 games for Israel. Barcelona and Juventus have agreed a swap deal for the midfielders Arthur and Pjanic with the Serie A champions also paying 10 million euros. Arthur, the 23-year-old Brazilian, did not want to move, initially wanting to stay at the Camp Nou, but Juventus convinced him. The deal values Pjanic at 60 million euros plus add-ons and Arthur at 70 million euros plus add-ons. Both players have to complete medicals and final details to finish the deal, but Arthur has agreed the deal at Juventus until 2025, while Pjanic has been offered the contract to 2024. Lucien Favre will stay on as Borussia Dortmund coach, Bild reports. The former Nice boss had been criticized for the team's performances this season, but it seems he will not leave before his contract expires in 2021. Talking about Dortmund again, sporting director Michael Zork has confirmed that the club are attempting to sign Akimi for the 2020-2021 season, while young talent Mokuku will soon join the first team squad. Akimi is currently on a two-year loan deal from Real Madrid and has made a huge impact during his time with the Bundesliga club developing in one of Europe's top attacking fullbacks. Ajax have signed 17-year-old Danish winger Iskil Dahl from Silkburg. Nice have signed 26-year-old French left-back Kamara from Reims. And finally to finish the video guys, Monaco defender Gilk could be set for a return to Serie A with two clubs interested in his services, Calcio Mercato reports. Torino and Benevento are both linked up with the move. The 32-year-old Polish international played more than 150 times in Serie A for Torino, having also spent time at Palermo and Bari. We reached the end of the video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, you already know like I said in the beginning, our goal for today is 500 likes in this video so don't forget to leave a like, it only takes one second of your time and it is really really important for me and for the channel to grow guys, so please don't forget to leave a like. Also, don't forget to leave a comment down below, that's really really important as well for the channel to grow, so leave a comment about the video, about rumors, confirmations, about anything that you want, I always answer every comment in my videos, subscribe if you're new guys, have a good Friday, stay safe, I'm Defaults and I'll see you guys in the next video.